Hey y'all! Hey y'all, it's me, Betsy from Happily Ever After, etc. And I am back with a fun video. So, as you know, I have been out on a cruise for a little while. Oh, it was a good trip, but I am glad to be home. And I am glad to be sharing you. That happens every single video. I try to log in to my live on my phone so I can see if anyone's commenting. And, of course, even if when I turn my sound off, I don't succeed. I'm doing something funny. Anyways, I am obsessed with Pandora. Have been for several years. My husband and my father-in-law actually bought me my bracelet um, the first Christmas we were together, and it has grown every year since then. My husband has bought me pretty much a charm for every holiday since he first got the bracelet. Christmas, um, Valentine's Days, um, our trip to Hilton Head, our trip to the beach, um, Fort Walton. So I've got quite a few charms now, but I have a couple more to finish this bracelet off. And the reason they are all off right now is because I got a couple new ones and I'm going to show them to y'all. And then I'm going to put them on. So let's see. I got two new, I guess you would say charms. Um, one's a charm and one is actually a safety chain because I finally decided, hey, it's time to get a safety chain. So we will see how I like it. Um, I've never had one on here, so I think it's just going to be kind of an adjustment. But now that I have so many charms, I think it will just make me feel better if I have the safety chain on there. So um, I went up to my local store, which is in Troy, Alabama. And they're a little boutique that has sells Pandora. So they came in this little bag, which is interesting. I've never actually been to this store before. The store that I typically go to is all the way down in Destin, which is a lot closer to my husband and my house, but not to my mom's house, which is where I'm at now. So it was a cute store, but they're smaller. And so I think that's why they were in that little bag instead of in an actual uh, Pandora box. Anyways. These are the charms I got. Sorry for the shadows. My mom's house is so shadowy. So here's the first one. It's the little cruise ship. It is so cute, you guys. And obviously, this is in honor of the cruise that my mom just took me on. It is really cute. All of the little islands we went to down in the Caribbean had like St. Kitts, Barbados, Puerto Rico written on the little charm on the bottom. I guess that's something you can have engraved. And so I decided I'm going to at some point get this one and engraved with Carnival on the bottom. I think that will be really cute. And he is going to go right here because I like to have Charm, dangly charm, charm, dangly charm. My last couple charms will go right here and then the pattern will be complete. So the other thing I got is this little safety charm. It's really cute. I wasn't sure I was going to like it because I thought that it was um, online. It looked like the beads were going to be like this big. Does not want to focus. And I just didn't want those big of beads on the end there. But these are much smaller. It's actually kind of funny. When I looked online, I liked the one that said, love always. Because basically all of these charms are from my husband. And I actually have a bracelet of his signature that says love always Trevor on it. And so I thought love always would be perfect. 
But when I got there, I just saw this one and I grabbed it because the lady was closing up. And uh, it said seven online, but when we got there, they actually close at six. And so I just went in to grab what I wanted. And I actually wanted the cruise ship and the dolphin because I went swimming with the dolphins, but they didn't have the dolphin. And so this was the second thing I wanted. So I went ahead and got it. I'll get the dolphin uh, next week when they have their sale. And I do like it, but I thought it said love always. And it actually says family forever. So I've never done this on video before and um, it's a little hard. So I'm just going to start putting everything back on here. I have these clips. These are the first clips that I had. They originally were in the middle of my bracelet. My husband bought them first for me. And then when I was having a really tough time last year, he took me out on a date and he bought me these gorgeous Delilah clips. I love them. Um, but I, I don't know. My bracelet isn't, wasn't full, isn't full. And so I didn't see any purpose to taking the other clips off. So I just have them on the ends. Um, I don't know if I'll keep them on there forever, but I kind of like the one on the end that kind of keeps all my clips charms from, from coming off because they definitely, I mean, these little babies are not cheap. I love Pandora. It's great quality. They're beautiful charms, but I do worry about, you know, something happening and my bracelet coming off and all my charms being gone just like instantly. That would be like my worst nightmare. And I don't know why I'm so worried about it because I'm wearing this thing for almost four years and it's never come loose when I haven't wanted it to. Oh my God, hitting things. So I don't know, but it makes me feel better to have the clips on the end. And since um, my husband bought them for me, I still do like them, even if I have new ones. And I don't know, I just like keeping all the ones he bought me on here. So we will see if I ever move them to a new bracelet. I am, I think I'm going to be finished with this bracelet next month. And so then I will start a new bracelet. This is the only Pandora bracelet I have. And so if I start a new one, I may move the clips over, but I really want the rose gold one. And so I don't really, I don't really see myself moving the braided clips over. They don't really go with the rose gold one, and honestly, my husband bought them for me, so I kind of want to keep them on this bracelet. Okay, so it doesn't always take this long to put these on, but I am really not good at it on camera. So when you're putting these on, I guess the only real thing you have to worry about is making sure, like, if you want a certain side up that you're being conscious of that when you're putting them on the bracelet. So like the little carriage really is the same from both sides. These have a front, so make sure those are up. Make sure whatever side you want a little couple is up. Make sure the little owl goes up the right way. So that's really the only thing you have to worry about. And I've been putting these on and off this bracelet for so long that I'm pretty conscious of which ones go where, which, I mean, I know it's my bracelet. They can go wherever I want, but I like them in a certain order. I like them to be as symmetrical as possible. So I'm almost done, and then we'll put it together, and we will see how it looks with all the charms on it. It feels a lot uh, fuller, even though I only got two new charms, it really drives me nuts. I've never had a full bracelet before, but it drives me nuts because I don't have as many on the sides as in the middle, and so it just falls unbalanced, and that drives me ridiculously insane because 
I want to see the pretty beads on top of my wrist, not the clasp. So I'm hoping once I have my balanced, uh, my bracelet balanced, that it will hang in the right way. And I think this will do it. It's not, like I said, it's not full. I have four more charms that I want to get for this bracelet. And then I will be done with it, which will be nice. I've never completed a Pandora bracelet before. So I put the little ship on. It looks really cute. I really like how it looks there. Sorry, you guys aren't even looking in the frame. And then you have to put the little safety chain on. And since mine has words on it, family forever, I want the words to be facing the same direction so you can read it. So basically, to put the safety chain on, you put it on first, and then you put it on last, so that it will make sure none of your charms fall off. And the way they design these is so cool. I don't know if you guys are into like the way things work, but I could not figure out when I saw them online how you know, it didn't just get tangled up every time the bracelet turned around. And it's because it has this little tiny piece right here. Do you see that? Like it's not just connected like on this side. It has this little screw so that it can twist and change. And it's quite awesome. So let's lay this out so you guys can see it. It definitely looks more balance, so we'll have to see how it looks on my wrist in a minute, because, man, putting this on on camera will not be fun. I'm just not that ambidextrous, y'all. Um, no. I think it's upside down, but that's okay. It should be right way up when I put it on. It definitely looks fuller. So the only ones I want left are going to go here, 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 and here. And we will see how they fit. They're all tiny, skinny little charms like the seahorse. And so this side, this ship takes up like a lot of real estate, which I didn't realize when I got it, but I still would get it for the cruise. And so like, do you see how much more room is on this side than this side now? So we'll see. If all four charms that I want don't fit, then I will just delegate some to the next uh, bracelet, and that would be okay. Okay, so I have to be conscious of this when I put it on to make sure that it's at the right way. Otherwise, um, the little guys won't be face up. So let's see if I can get this fairly quickly, because sometimes it's quick and sometimes it's not quick. Oh, it's quick! Oh, you guys are so lucky. Okay. So let's get all the little beans right. Yeah. They're all facing up. Yay! Every once in a while I still mess up, even though I've been doing it for forever. So that looks way more balanced. I love it. I can't wait to get those last couple beads and I will definitely do the Rula La unboxing on Friday when I get that in. I can't wait. I am completely obsessed. If I had 58 million bajillion dollars, I would just go and order like all the ones that I want, but I'm not that cool. So thanks for watching y'all. I love the little ship. I will be really happy when it says carnival. And I actually really like the little safety chain. I didn't realize that it said family forever instead of love always, but it's kind of appropriate because it will always be family. He will always be my husband. And I do like it. So I think I'm just going to go ahead and keep it since I have it. And I do like it. So I'll see you all on Friday. Bye.